Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the bomber number 5010-407-640. This is a plain bearing, five knuckle, full mortise, wide throw steel base, four by seven, removable pin hinge, and an oil rubbed bronze finish. Okay, so let's start by dissecting the part number. The 50, the 50 part of the part number means that it is a, uh, f uh, it is a five knuckle hinge that is full mortise, five knuckle, versus Bomber's uh, three knuckle design. It means that it is uh, plain bearing. There are no ball bearings at all, which would, uh, if you wanted ball bearings, that's an option. That'd be the BB prefix to the part number. Uh, also means that in, this is an oil rubbed hinge, so I want to keep my fingers off of it as much as possible. You can see from the swag on the hinge leaf there that the hinge is intended to be mortised when the leafs are brought flush together. It's a full mortise hinge. You can even smell the oil rubbed process on this hinge. Um, it's a full mortise hinge, so it's mortised to the edge of the door and frame. The one after the 50 means that it is a wide throw hinge, and we'll talk more about that in a minute, except that it is wider than it is tall. I suppose a wide throw hinge could also be a hinge that's narrower than it is tall. Don't know that. Um, the zero in the part, the last zero, means that it is a steel based hinge. Okay, An option there would be stainless steel. Well, that wouldn't be stainless steel. It would be bronze-based material if you wanted oil-rubbed finish, which would be an 11, 5011. Uh, 407 is a reference to the size. The height is first on hinges like this. That is always and for sure how they must be called out. You call this a 7 by 4 or someone's going to say, what are you talking about? This is a 4 by 7. Not a 7 by 4 wouldn't be a problem, but a 5 by 4 and a half could be a problem, or a 5 by 4. So height first, 4 by seven. The 640 part of the part number mean the 640 part of the part number means two things. It first means that it is oil rubbed bronze finish, but it is on a steel base. If this was going to be an oil rubbed finish on a solid bronze, the part number would turn into 613, and that would specifically means mean bronze base material. Um, there is a link below this video to the cut sheet. It shows everything important dimensionally about this hinge, including the fact that the leaf thickness is 130 thousandths, a little about an eighth of an inch. Um, references Bomber's other part numbers in the steel column, your 5,000, your 5010, your 8,000, which is a three knuckle version of this hinge, your ball bearing versions, then your column for the brass and bronze base material, and that changes based on the finish oil rubbed bronze or satin bronze is on a bronze base, polished brass, satin brass, that would all be on a uh, brass base material. Then your stainless steel, of course, that's going to be polished or satin. You can see how the part numbers change depending on ball bearing, the number of knuckles, uh, etc. Gives a location of the screw holes, and speaking of screw holes, screws are included in a complementary finish. Okay. This is called a template pattern which is the, the standard pattern for hinges. Um, moving on down the line, let's talk about why you would use this. Uh, wide throw hinges are generally used because, well, you've got an exterior door that swings out and you've got unusually thick casing or brick mold on it. You could have an interior door within the same condition where you have unusually thick uh, casing. You could have, and I've seen this uh, in places, a door that's set further into the frame than standard. For instance, when you stand on the pull side of the hinge, pardon me, the pull side of the door, the door, if you ran your hand over the face of the door in the frame, the door is inset ever so slightly, 3 30 seconds of an inch, something very small. Well, if you inserted that in, say an inch, now you have an issue with a wide throw hinge requirement. And if you're thinking of wide throw hinges, you might want to also think about extended lip strike plates as well. Um, you could have issues unrelated to doors. You could be hanging windows in a wall and they're set in deep and you want to be able to open the windows, not just to 90, but to get them to wrap around the face of the wall. So you might need that. Now keep in mind, compared to a four by four, 
this hinge shifts the axis of pivoting out an additional inch and a half which is 7 minus 4 is 3 divided by 2 because the hinge is closed. That'll give you another 3 inches of clearance around that to help you get way out and around something. I've also had people buy these because they have four doors in an opening, two outer doors, two inner doors. The outer and inner doors are hinged to each other. They want to fold those back and around, but then the outer doors need to fold back and around as well so that it all stacks open. That's another application. Something obviously you have to lay out and determine uh, what you're needing in terms of uh, wide throw. Um, options on this hinge. And if you have any questions about applications, please feel free to reach out. Options. There's lots. This is a square corner hinge. That's inherently part of the part number as well. Quarter inch radius, 5 eighths radius, no problem. Security options. If you have an outswinging door, uh, you might want to consider a non-removable pin or a security stud, something that will prevent someone from driving the pin out. Uh, decorative tips. This is called a button tip. If you use your imagination, it looks like a button. Ball tip is the most common after that. Steeple tip, urn tip, acorn tip can all be done. Okay. Uh, all of the other options that we talked about uh, earlier as well. And uh, the last thing I'd like to point out to you would be the Bomber logo. Right above it, it says Made in USA, a fact that Bomber is quite proud of, as am I to be a distributor of theirs. If you have any questions on the Bomber number 5010-407-640, wide throw hinge and an oil rubbed bronze finish, or any other Bomber product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you.